Mm. So the doors are all open, so there might be some background noise, which I apologise for. Um, I'm I'm going to do a quick uh, video for one of my customers, but I'm going to make it generalised so I can use the content for myself. Um, and this is about adding deals to the to the website, um, specifically using Vark Tech. Uh, pricing deals. Now, this is the pro version as well, so not the uh, not the standard on the pro version. Um, before I go into this, the one thing to remember is that any of these deals you do are are down to pure logic. So at no time can the machine or anything make up something or decide to do something or 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 guess at it. You have to tell it exactly what to do. Otherwise, it just won't work. Um, now, the stuff that we're looking at is in the left here, under the pricing deals rules. A bit of a mouthful, I know. Um, if you go into the pricing deals rules, <laughs> you'll you'll see the ones that we've currently got, and I've and I've named these in the months that they were um, they were applicable for. Um, I'll show you the current one, and I'll show you what the current one does. So, so when we go into the current one, the, the June version, the, the top is kind of the stuff that controls the uh, the visibility of this, controls the kind of the basic initial settings. Um, so here's a here's the discount either to the cart or the, or the catalog. So on the cart, it's going to apply it to all the products that people see. Um, sorry, the catalog on, on on the cart like we've got now. It's going to apply a discount to the cart. So when somebody's bought some stuff or put stuff in their cart, there's going to be the ability to discount it. What it's not doing is adding discount to to items that are available to purchase at at a discount. For example, they they'd be catalog type discounts. So when we're when we're say doing a you know if you buy six you get one free. That's a that's a, a a cart discount because you've bought six you're gonna get one free if we're saying 20 percent off each one that's that's more like a catalog discount um we we've got a deal type here so buy one get one um and, and when you go further down you'll see that that's that's the type that's not necessarily what you're going to do you, you might buy one get three buy two get four buy five get whatever um we, we're going to determine that later on um and then we've got the action. We we set this to buy something, discount the next item. And there are a couple of options. Um, when you buy something, you discount the actual item you're buying. So buy two, get fifty percent off, that kind of stuff. Um, but this is buy something, discount the next item. So we're setting this up. So if you buy a number of things, you will get a different number of things for free. Um, and that that's the premise of what we're doing now. Um, I've got basic rules open there. The wizard is on. Um, and for what we're doing, this box here is normally rule is always on, but we need to put that to on or off um, and then schedule it. So using the boxes here, we'll schedule it. And obviously, if it's if it's your future one, it'll be off and then you'll you'll put the begin time and end time in it and then it'll then, it'll then change it to rule is on. Um, and um, you'll then the, the, the element will come live on the day you've, you've specified and it'll come thing i think to be aware of it'll come live on server time so like in british summertime that'll be like one o'clock in the morning on the day so just be aware of that um yeah so that's that's kind of the the setup of it then we come into this bit which is the um what you're actually going to do and in the top here and it, and <laughs> I think it's wrong that it's this colour. It should be a lot a lot brighter. There should be a, a distinction on it. But this is the buy group. So this is what do you have to buy to qualify for this discount. So I've got by single product with variation. So you have to buy the product number, which I've put in there, which gives you glitter lips, uh, and then the variations that you have to buy. So you can buy any, any of those. You can also say that only certain people can qualify for it or leave it blank for everyone um group amount then by unit quantity when you put by unit quantity you get a box to the right here that says how many so we are selling six any six of these yeah will allow you to have something free the next box what we're saying is that if you buy 12 you can have the deal again if you buy 18 you have it again okay you can have that so it's just once um, but this is, you know, every every six you buy, you'll 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 have the ability to get it free. 
Um, so that's the buy group. We've now got the get group. What do I get if I qualify in the buy section? And I, we've got the same thing again by single product with variations. So we've added the product number with glitter lips, but this time we're only adding diamond in the buff and Midas. So we're only adding those two shades. Um, the amount, so discount the next one. So we're, we're saying discount the next item you buy. So six plus the one, so, th so the seventh item. Um, as long as it's in one of those two shades will be free. And we put it in a free discount product price. Now, this is where I may disagree with the way that we've done this deal by offering two different shades. If we'd offered one shade, we could have used the next button here, which would automatically give the customer that free gift in, 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 the, in the basket. They'd automatically get it. They wouldn't have to do anything for it. Um, they'd get it. And, and obviously, we can't do that because the, the system can't guess what the person wants. Yeah, it's got, there's got to be a, a, clear, a clear thing for what it wants. Um, it'd be good if we could, but, but we can't. So we, we have to put um, a message up. And the message that we put up if you call off is, um, in here should be something like, uh, you know, um, well done, you qualified for the gift or you know, that, that, that kind of stuff. Um, and then we've also got a message to advertise the, uh, the deal. Um, I think we've got other places, but this... This message advertises on that. Now, the, the reason we're using this is because this is scheduled. So because we've scheduled it, um, what you don't want to do is at 1 o'clock in the morning to be going into here and putting this advert wherever it is. So we, we put the contents of the advert in this box, and then we use a short code to place that advert. Yeah, and I'll show you what we've in a sec, but I'll just I'll just recap this. So the top box here sets the kind of the parameters for what your the, the type of offer you're you're offering and sets the schedule for when it starts and when it ends. The buy group is <clears throat> as it says, what you have to buy to qualify. The get group is what you get if you qualify. And then we've got a bit here about how how you get it free and stuff and, and if you know it's 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 the it's if it's the uh, if it's the next item and and so on and so forth um so so that's that's adding it one there i i'd suggest maybe when you do the next one is you click add new you click july you set it up with the dates and stuff um and leave it to go there what will happen then is <clears throat> when when the june one finishes and the july one takes over this will this will turn off the july one will turn on and the message should change automatically. Um, we've added the message here. And if I go into um, widgets. And we look at this month's special deal. You'll see here we've got the English version. Pricing deals message standard. So that's the short code that puts that the content of that box in this box here. So, so that's how that works. Um, a, a, a slight point and the other thing that we're using we, we're also using at some point where we, we are using um the variable product the, sorry the, the variable price one the um and the variable price one is is more concerned with um changing the price for certain things so buy four get 10 percent off buy five get 20 percent off it, it'll even go as far as saying if if a customer reaches a you know if they've spent a thousand pounds with you, they'll get five percent off. So it's more that that one's more to do with getting a specific amount of money off a, off a product. It's not very good at giving people items for other items. It's not it's not good at getting rid of stock that you may want to get rid of um, free with other stock that, that kind of flies out the door. Um, I think that's it. That so that's the uh, that's the the Vark Tech pricing deals. And uh, all that's left for us to do is, is to go over a bit with it, with um, the translator, with the WPM, but that's a, that's a bit of work for later. Okay, I hope, I hope that helps.